Blues fan CB, Chelsea nil, Manchester United 2. Ben, I think that's the most annoying match I've ever watched in my life. I don't know what it was, but it weren't football. VAR's already killed that. It's a fucking joke, genuinely. I don't know how the fuck they're doing that. Fucking, back, as for the was pushed into fucking whoever it was. And not even that deep. Yeah, not even that. It's, it's the lightest thing. The ref was giving free kicks for less, for, um, for more. And fucking, he was letting more go than that. But, you know, it's just United doing their usual thing, cashing checks for VAR, cashing checks for referees. They're fucking spoiled brats up north. They can't take a fucking loss. Fucking, they're just absolute twats. And speaking of twats, that's UIE. I don't care. I don't care if anyone here loves him. If you do, don't even be a Chelsea fan. He's a fucking prick. He should never wear a fucking Chelsea shirt again. I don't care if he won us a title. That year, someone else would have won us a title anyway. He can fuck off. He's shit. Batshuayi is done. She rude when he come on, put more effort into that game than Batshuayi has done all fucking season. The boy is done. Fuck him off on loan. Give him the fucking Morata treatment. I've never seen someone that's maybe missed Morata and fucking Higuain. Higuain with a broken leg is better than Batshuayi. Fuck him. <laughs> right, let's move on to another one of the questionable decisions. Caballero starting in goal. Looking back on it now, do you think it was the right decision for us or not? Kepa would have probably conceded five, so yeah. Not really. He didn't play that bad. Yeah. Uh, Kepa ain't got the fucking heart anymore. You know? He doesn't look like he wants to try. He's just fucking, you know, £75 million goalkeeper, whatever how much we paid for him. He just doesn't care. Like, uh, Caballero, he's making effort. And even then, Caballero's still the wrong person because he's been done since the fucking World Cup. We haven't got a goalkeeper at Chelsea. We know we're going back to the scenario when we don't have a, a good keeper. And now we're looking and... and and this is just a, a massacre of long things. This is the reason why we haven't fucking been done. We haven't signed anyone in January. We got fucking a court ruling saying we could sign January, and all we've done is sign Ziyech, who's coming in the summer. Way too late. He should be doing playing today. What, something else as well is, again, VAR, because it's VAR as well. VAR has killed fucking football. I don't care. You heard every single Chelsea fan singing, this ain't football anymore. You're not going to... At least, if you're going to use it, use it right. Fucking use it right. Top four, so top five now, because obviously Man City ain't getting Champions League. There should have been more fucking urgency from Chelsea. Tottenham were one point behind us when we kicked off, and now they've got a chance to go above us. And if we play like we did in that fucking first half, Tottenham will go above us. Tottenham will fucking do us. And I could just see it fucking coming. If Tottenham go above us, mate, I, I don't know what I'm going to fucking do, because Tottenham don't deserve top four. But at the moment, the way we're playing, we don't deserve it either. There is no heart at the moment. Lampard's trying his fucking best. Now, fair play to him. He hasn't had as much um, as he could. He didn't get to sign in the summer, and for some reason, we didn't sign in January. So, something needs to be fucking sorted. And next year, when we spend big, that's when you judge Lampard. Anyone who's saying Lampard out after this is an absolute idiot. Don't know.